Hello, welcome to Sun, Moon, Star Tarot, where I encourage you to pursue your soul. These next four bell sounds are to align us and to bless your reading. This is going to be a random message of the day for the sign of Capricorn. Again, um, I usually use my cards for this, my astrological cards, but I was kind of like channeling and Capricorn came up. And so yeah, um, this is going to be a message of the day for Tuesday, October 20th, 2020. Again, Tuesday, October 20th. 2020 all right and it's going to be for capricorn so tell me what's going on for capricorn spirit you're going to do thoughts feelings emotions so thoughts times are changing things are changing rapidly around you at this time and it may be kind of hard for you to keep up because it may be like one day something this thing happened and the next day it's just totally like a different world but it's a, a whole new world um a whole new world uh i think it's pocahontas I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure that's Pocahontas or Aladdin. I don't know. I just a whole new world is playing in my head. I, again, I really have no clue what Disney Princess saying that song. Um, but things are changing basically around you, and this it may feel like a whole new world, a brand new world, a brand new cycle that you're in, a brand new um, yeah cycle because this is all about ten, especially is about something ending, something beginning. Um, and then just that energy exchange there. And then feelings, we have Nine of Wands. So there is some defensive energy here. Um, why, is this, why is Nine of Wands here? Why is Nine of Wands here? We have Page of Pentacles. So maybe you're a little bit guarded because you really want this to wherever this, um, whatever this endeavor is to work out. But you're being asked to believe that this is a very um, sacred path for you to take. Basically, this is a very sacred path for you to take at this time. I'm getting this owl is really sticking out to me. So lots of wisdom surrounding you at this time. All right. And then uh, spirit, we have balance. So you are coming into a time of balance, into a time of feeling very even. All right. And then here we have the moon. So this may be even around you developing your intuition at this time. Um, this balance is leading to your intuition being developed. And just, I'm getting, especially because this page of pinnacles is here, I'm getting like a lot of doors opening up for you. Um, in the physical world, yes. Um, but we want to see what comes out here. Uh, but really, your intuition really blossoming and opening up at this time. The moon is all about the unknown. But it's having the ability to navigate in the unknown, basically. And I believe the moon is linked to either Cancer or Pisces. Um, I could actually check to make sure in this handy dandy book. All right, so the moon, 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 the moon. The chariot is Cancer, so yeah, Pisces must be the moon. Yeah. So really using your in intuition and developing your intuitive abilities at this time. Um, balance, yielding those results, right? And then what is coming in the material world? What's coming in the material world? Thank you. All right. So here we have the Queen of Swords and here we have the Knight of Swords, all right? So this is letting you know that you are learning. You are really so much in your mental energy and that's totally okay if this is how you're processing uh, whatever this event is, that's totally fine. But remembering to kind of like, I don't want to let bygones be bygones, but not holding on to any um, emotional baggage. For the Queen of Swords, she is someone who can power through, but she is also someone who can be holding on to the past a little bit. And the Knight of Swords is letting me know that this is, um, this process will be very quick for you, all right? Bottom of the deck here, we have giving and receiving, six of pentacles, death, a new transition, a new beginning period. We have ace of pentacles, perhaps more finances coming in for you, and we have a three of swords. Yeah, so this is definitely after a period of separation, after a period of something is kind of like not turning out, not, not turning out not in your favor, but just having that um, awakening, that separation, basically, right? 
So thank you so much for watching Capricorn. I hope you found this video to be helpful. Please make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Do know that I'm offering a powerful, powerful six week leadership program. If you're interested, everything you need to know is in the description box down below, including my landing page, www.spiritualgenia.com, where you can book your free 30 minute consultation call where we can discuss this program further in detail so we can get you more acquainted. And you can book your private reading with me at www.thesunwindstartuo.com. Um, there and we can connect there and then you can also connect with me on Instagram at spiritually Gina. Thank you so much for watching, YouTuber. Namaste.